Hello everybody, Jean here. In this presentation I'll be showing you blocks and slabs photographed by the Rover Curiosity at a site on Sol 618. I think it was Will Farrar from What's Up in the Sky who originally discovered these. Let's have a look at the source material and then I'll show you close-ups of these blocks and slabs. The mast cam photographed these three photographs on Sol 618 way back in 2014 0503 and as always I'll include the link to these original NASA pages in the video description so you can go check these out for yourself. He has the original photograph downloaded from the NASA site and yeah, I've removed that red filter and we'll be looking at these blocks in the foreground. I'll show you the gigapans as well towards the end of the video. So check out the block over here folks. Nice slab. There we've got a block with a bevel like design on it. This block over here has got this weird almost like a table top to it. And another slab of here in the foreground. And then we've got a strange geometric shape to that one way back there in the background. I estimate the block of here to be about a meter, meter and a half in length. However, I can't say for sure, folks. There's no scale indicator for these photographs. Yeah, we're looking at a close-up of those blocks zoomed in twice the original size and check that one out got neat straight edges right angles uniformity in thickness so what could this be folks a destroyed structure Let's have a look at some of the other blocks at the site. So this photograph also 2014-0503, mast camera Sol 618. The original from the NASA site. The red filter removed. We'll check out the block over here. I estimate that one to be about 800 millimeters across, almost a meter. As I say, folks, I'm speculating here. Now check that out. Nice right angles, straight edges, multiple layers to this piece. I seem to extend past this one side. And there's this protruding piece way at the back there. Strange ornate design to that one. Block Avia. Lots of right angles to these pieces. And the last photograph, Sol 618, Mast Cam 2014 0503. The original from the NASA site. The red filter removed, so let's zoom in on the blocks and slabs of here. Check this out. There's another view of that block with that flat piece on top. Slab sticking out here. Another one of here, folks. Right, let's have a look at those three photographs at twice the original scale. We'll zoom in here. It's strange that there's this carved out piece to that block. Neat geometry 
to that one there. Strange grey L shaped piece embedded in that boulder. Some shards over there. Another slab of here in the foreground. See another block of here to the bottom left. There's that other L shaped piece. Right, let's check out the block in this one. Got like four layers part on the side, yeah. Strange item sticking up there. It's almost like a sculpted piece. We've got these boulders that appear to have been melted. It's also a very interesting item here. Yeah. These slots to it, spaced evenly apart. It's almost metallic in nature. Check out the right angle there. We've got that part that fits into what looks like a slot. And this larger block. Block that seems to be carved. Hollowed out. It seems to continue back there. Comes up to a point. Of here to the left. And then the last close up. Let's check out the slab of here. The smooth flat surfaces. Strange layer on top of this block. Looks like another slab or two over here to the left. So it looks rather strange. I'll include the link to those three close-ups in the video description as well. I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, give it a huge thumbs up, share it with like-minded friends, and I look forward to reading your comments. I haven't responded to the comments on my latest two videos, I have read them folks, thank you for those, I'm just a little busy at this stage, so I'm not ignoring you, I have read them, and I value your feedback a lot. As always, thanks for watching.